Layer transparency, setting the transparency. Things can be opaque, means you cannot see through them. When things are transparent, mean that we can see through them. We use this transparency effect in many different types of drawing requirements, and particularly architectural, civil, and many technical illustrations. So, in this example, we have a golf hole, and there's a hatch pattern, these lines that represent uh, a mowing pattern, like when the mower runs across the, across the fairway. We kind of want them to be more subdued. So, to set them, we're going to go up to our layer transparencies. We're going to pick on the mower pattern. And in the transparency, I'm going to change the transparency from opaque, being very bold, to something very faint. And I'm going to set the value like at 85. And I'm going to hit OK. And now I'm going to close. Now, those lines are a lot fainter. I'll zoom in on them more. You can see that the lines are just ever so faint. Let's change them back to opaque so we can see the difference again. We go back to 85 and we'll change this, say, to zero. So they're very opaque. And our values go from zero to not 90. All right, so very thick, heavy lines at this point. So we can use that whenever we want to see through something. Uh, so we can set our transparency at a high number if we want to see through it. Um, so many applications uh, can use this uh, transparent and it's particularly good when we have some text or some patterns and we'll talk about these hatch patterns later on but when we're trying to see one thing on top of another usually is a very good application of transparency